Let's try that. Let's try that. Let's try that. Let's try that. All righty. Alrighty, well, I don't know um, if anybody's even watching this, but this is going to be a good test stream. So if anybody's on here, let me know how it's going.
All right. I know at least one of you has sent the link to down here watching. Ah, my boys. Sam and Dalton, thank you guys for checking my first stream out. This is what's up. You guys let me know how it's looking. Stream's very clear and very smooth. That's what I like to hear. I do have to say, I think it... I'm not even paying attention. I do think it's a little bit delayed. From when I was watching it, it had like a... Probably a 20 second delay in there. I don't know if that's normal or not. Don't think viewers are able to see the delay like you, he says. No, but what I'm saying is when I asked you how it looked, that was like that was like a couple minutes ago, I feel like. So I'm just maybe I need to pull a stream up on a separate device and check it out. I also need to put my stream chat chat on my screen like right up here somewhere because I've got it on my second monitor and I can like not really uh, see it efficiently. If I'm going to be watching it, I'm definitely going to have to have it up in front of me a little bit. Sano is a good track. This is going to be really fun in a GT3 or a GT4, maybe even a P3. It's going to be good fun. Um, the iRacing scan compared to ACC, again, I just saw that you said that. Um, I don't have that much time on the ACC scan, to be honest. I mean... The eye racing scan, it's dude, it's immaculate, man. Um, but like, you know, I don't think it's a lie that ACC, like, they do a really good job with their scans, like, artistically. It's, you know, no secret. But I mean, it's just, it's a definitely a quality eye racing scan, man. The uh, the curbs feel nice. 
the off tracks are really reasonable even though that they're even though there's runoffs in a lot of areas like I have to say this is going to be a fun one in a GT3 like I went way off right there for the finish line no off track so that was nice See, that's what happens when I look at chat. Need to have that chat up on my main screen. <laughs> Had that natural tempest system D. Ah, shit. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Yeah, no uh, tempest system in the Porsche Cup yet. So I really wanted to get some laps around Misano being a new track. So obviously, Porsche Cup isn't necessarily my thing, but yeah, this track's good, man. I'm glad I decided to get a few laps on it. Hopefully. GT3 fixed for the last few days will have some like clear weather because I'm really getting over driving in the rain. cut that corner a lot yeah yeah big streamer guy I literally um i got my internet fixed it's been a process well i didn't get my internet fixed i uh got a starlink set up so i now have good enough internet to stream tristan it's been a process i've been on iRacing for like four years now and i haven't even been able to really race so this is a cool step for me First stream, first stream. I don't even know how things look, to be honest with you. I probably need to move my black boxes around and whatnot, but yeah, just seeing how it, seeing how it goes, seeing if it runs smooth.
Yeah, yeah, no, definitely. Um, the SOB Wi-Fi. I even have my um my own like private network here at Saab, and it don't work much better than the public Wi-Fi. So, I've either been racing the last few years on hotspot on my phone, which isn't ideal because I also don't have good phone service, and then um. Yeah, I kind of, I just got fed up with it, man, and I want to watch Supercross. I want to watch that stuff in HD without screen legs, so I told my wife, buckle down, we uh, ended up getting the Starlink set up, and it's been good so far. I haven't raced with it yet, but we'll see. I got minimal latency and not a lot of packet loss, so I'm thinking, I'm hoping it should work fine. Oh, I was looking at chat. I was looking at chat and locked him up. Hold on. Let's go back to the pits really quick. All right. I need to move that relative black box just a little bit. I actually don't even use the iRacing black boxes anymore. I use iOverlay. Or I have been at least. This is the first time I'm using my. So I overlays how I'm gonna get the sh the stream on chat as well. So. Let's try that with the black boxes. Now y'all can see what I'm actually doing. I've got five views on this thing now, man. I'm gonna go, this stream's gonna, this whole streaming thing's gonna blow up for me. I'm telling you what. But not from the bottom of my heart. I appreciate you guys checking this out. I've been waiting to do this for years, Dalton, you know. Ooh, woo, woo, woo. I really actually want to race this, but being official, I'm like, I take advantage of week 13 not being official. So uh, Porsche Cup being official isn't really like something that I want to do. Um, No, I, I don't use race labs just because... Um, I haven't used it since I had my old computer, and it, like, really took a lot of uh, computing. Like, it made my computer lag super bad because my old build wasn't very beefy. So um, I didn't use any of that type of stuff for a while, just what iRacing offered. But um, also, RaceLab apps started charging, which it's not very much. I think it's, like, $4 a month or something. But iOverlay does pretty much everything RaceLab does, and it's free. It's a new overlay kind of deal that's been started, and um, yeah, I'm pretty fond of it. After I do a lap or two here, I'll go start it up and see if I can't get the chat on screen here.
Oh, I'll tell you what, this track is actually a lot of fun, though. Like, off, like I said, off tracks are fair. A lot of fun. Spin ya. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There's a lockup. That's why I don't race Porsche Cup. trying to think should I post the link on my Facebook or my Instagram or something see if I can get some max viewers up in this piece another spinala You start cutting that. You can cut that a lot too. We'll see if um, by the time we go official, we'll see how they adjust track limits here. Kind of a sketchy pit area entrance there, eh? Oop, and there's a the spin yellow. Anyways, let's get on something that I might actually race later because I'm not racing anything official in week 13, and that's just how it is. Let's see. Let's edit. <laughs> Let's edit the title of my live stream. Hmm. 
There we go. All right, should we do some uh, some funny forecast, or should we do some? Where's it at? Where's it at? Where's it at? Or should we do some wet and wild at Spa in the LMP2? Let's go with that. Let's go with that. Um. So week 13 GT3, or should, should we do wet and wild? One of my three concurrent viewers, let me know. LMP2, fair enough. All right, here we go. Going to do some laps at Spa on the P2 now. I probably need to get on and stream tonight and do some races. I don't think I have time to do any races right now, being a dad of two kids. But now that I know how all this works and I'm trying to learn how to run my stream clearly, I'm going to get on tonight and try to figure some stuff out as well. Ah, this is really exciting for me. This is really exciting, actually. I've been waiting years to do this. All right, now on my YouTube studio, I've got it cut up so I can see that there's not a big delay. That makes me feel better. All right, let's uh, let's do this damn thing. I racing setups. Let's go um, baseline wet. <coughs> let's try that. Let's try that. If I don't risk it, I'm, <laughs> yeah, well, D, I'm risking it just being in this P2 in the rain, man. That's risky enough, baby. This, this shit's hairy. So I haven't driven the um, P2 in the rain yet. I tried to do, like, literally two laps. I tried to do a lap or two, like, at Sebring the other day in a, uh, in a GTP, and that, like, did not work out. Literally did not work out for me. Oh, yes. So my buddy Sam told me that the uh, P2 feels probably the best car in the rain right now. So I can already feel this thing feels way more planted than the GT3 and the GTPs do. Like, this thing feels way more planted on this on this surface, on this wet surface. So that's cool, man, because I was going to about lose complete faith in the rain. But, like, this P2 is a little bit more reasonable, I feel like. Oh, yeah, don't hit the curbs. Don't hit the curbs or that happens. So, yeah, um, no curbs. No curbs. I kind of forgot you can't use race line here. So no race line. No race line, no curbs, or you die. Lesson learned.
Here to have a good time, right? Not here to die. Shit. Oh my goodness. Holy crap. I barely touched the brakes right there. Can't see. I am not the biggest fan of this rain, but like this Tempest system and this rain looks amazing on Sim. Like they really did do a good job. And I can't see nothing. I can't see anything. Oh, yes. Gonna take some getting used to here. Ah, stuck on the curbs. Ah, locking up. And front end's pushing, dude, pushing. Oh, my God. And I'm dead. And it's gone. All right, good fun, guys. I think I'm about done with this rain stuff. So, like, there's that. Oh, man, I just, I want to drive some dry conditions i want to drive dry conditions other than porsche cup for week 13 
iRacing's really doing the most, making everything torrential rain. Really doing the most. Like, really, really doing the most. I'm not really enjoying this. See, I think even Battle of the Little Wings, yeah, 99% chance of rain. Come on, man. Like, GT3 Challenge, 100% chance of rain. How about Fix Ferrari? Fix Ferrari, 100% chance of rain. So, yeah. That's making me not want to participate in week 13, which is a big deal for me, because usually that's um, not the case. Who's winning what in week 13? GT3, so the Audi, Lambo, Porsche, it looks, yeah, whatever, you can pick anything you want. All right, well, here's the deal. I'm going to end this stream because, like, there's nothing I really want to drive right now but Porsche Cup, and I'm not going to waste my time racing that since, as I said, it's official. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to turn this stream off, and I'm going to do an official, like, good stream later. That's what I'm going to do. Actually, yeah, no, that's exactly what I'm going to do. That's exactly what I'm going to do. So peace out, guys. Stream's ending.